Always seems like we always have a long way to go. But I also, uh, today, we're taking steps to confront not just the gun crisis, but what is actually a public health crisis. Nothing, nothing I'm about to recommend in any way impinges on the Second Amendment. There are phony arguments suggesting that these are Second Amendment rights at stake from what we're talking about. But no amendment, no amendment to the Constitution is absolute. You can't yell crowd, you can't yell fire in a crowded movie theater. We call a freedom of speech. From the very beginning, you couldn't own any weapon you wanted to own. From the very beginning of the Second Amendment existed, certain people weren't allowed to have weapons. So the idea is just bizarre to suggest that some of the things we're recommending are contrary to the Constitution. Gun violence in this country is an epidemic. Let me say it again. Gun violence in this country is an epidemic, and it's an international embarrassment. Our flag was still flying at half-staff for the victims of the horrific murder of eight primarily Asian-American people in Georgia, when 10 more lives were taken in a mass murder in Colorado. You probably didn't hear it, but between those two incidents, less than one week apart, there were more than 850 additional shootings. 850 that took the lives of more than 250 people and left 500, 500 injured. This is an epidemic, for God's sake, and it has to stop.